Hi. Hi, my Nitish. My name is Nitish. Nice to meet you. And where do you live? I live in India. And so are you a student in India or are you working? Mm, I'm a farmer. A farmer? And yeah. what what kind of um crops or what what kind of farm do you have? Uh, I do several, you know, I grow several uh, type of crops but mostly vegetables. Mostly vegetables. And why would you like to practice your English? Actually, when I was in school at that time, I didn't learn it, you know, with very serious. I didn't learn it very well, you know. And then no, now I realize that yeah, it's an important language and very necessary to learn. That is why, just for you know, uh, collect more knowledge about the language. And so, would you, would speaking better English help you as a farmer, or is it just for? um as a challenge or as a hobby as a challenge as a hobby yeah it is very important to you know convey uh, our thought to a uh, variety of people you know most of the people in india they don't know um, you know um, my language because my native is bengali language and most of the people they speak hindi and some people uh, speak another kind of language in india there are multiple languages like tamil malayalam gujarati uh, several languages and uh, they don't uh, know bengali but, but i speak bengali so in my state only i can convey my thought to my people and you know india is my own country but uh, i can't you know i am quite unable to express my thoughts to other so it is a very you know uh, it's awful yeah that that that's very interesting because like you said it's your home country but there are so so many other indians that you can't communicate with because you all speak different versions different yeah. dialects different languages yeah uh, so there is only one option the english english, english <laughs> is a linking is there so english is a linking language so yeah. everybody know about english but uh, you know no not very well nobody is very you know yeah some people are very literate they know english very well in india yeah they know very well but uh, you know most of the people they don't know and a few people they are very good in english yeah, in india yeah yeah and so so for the crops that you grow do you sell them to outside of your area or do you would it be helpful to it is very close is very close actually my local market is around 2 and 1/2 km oh okay 2 and 1/2 km far and uh, local vendors come uh, come there to buy products and they sell it to the city yeah and so what types of things are you growing what types of produce or vegetables like brinjal chilies pumpkin cucumber beans And so what season is it right now what are you currently growing or harvesting right now bring the this is time for cucumber yeah cucumber <laughs> and uh, cucumber needs a lot of water and so uh, um, this is my my work to watering you know is is it a fam uh, is, is it a family business hmm hmm yeah yeah my family members also go to you know pick the uh, vegetables from the plants we go early in the morning and pick the um, crops like vegetables uh, from plants then i go and my brother also help me and, to sell them in the market and so did your parents have this farm when you were little yeah yeah, yeah. i am very used to it this from my childhood yeah and so how many um How many years has this farm been in your family? Was it your grandparents even? Mm, yes. So it's been a long time in your family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And so do you have a very big family? You have a brother? Do you have any other sis brothers or sisters? I have a I I have a younger brother. He is still studying. Yeah. He's still still studying, but part of this also you also uh, give his hand to help us. <laughs> and and, uh, 
And so do you think that the farming industry is improving or is it getting more difficult and through the years what have you seen in your community with farming yeah it's uh, not good yeah it's not good because we don't get a lot of money by selling them because uh, there is uh, you know other communicator the mediator they come and they sell you know in shop they sell it's very high price but when we go because we when we go 100 kg product to sell 100 and 200 kg product sell at that time we can't uh, demand for a big sum of money because then they refuse to buy it yeah i uh, you know there is in a good uh, there is no good regulate you know regulatory system to watch the all what is going on and some yeah there is some regulation but that is very far away from our village yeah. so to reach regularly there it is impossible so what, this is the only reason we sell them in local market it is uh, uh, you know easy to go there and for that reason we uh, sometimes we face the loss yeah so it's very difficult as a small independent farmer maybe if you're part of a bigger company maybe it's different yeah and so what do you think um how do you think things will go in the next 10 20 30 years well, how do you think 